Before we get started, I just want to let y'all know that I have come a long way from where I used to be. This is me five days postpartum from giving birth to twins. If you know me, you know that I was obsessed with my stomach. Like literally, it was bad. I was completely distraught after I had kids and realized that this was my stomach for the rest of my life. And then I slowly started to accept that it was okay that I had flaws on something that I once thought was perfect. I can always improve. If you at rock bottom, you can only go up. Being completely transparent, I was very inconsistent with my workouts, but I did the same ab routine monthly. And I know that's how I started getting results and my skin started tightening up. And a year and a half later, here I am today. Of course, this had a little extra work put in, but I'm gonna show you the main cause of these abs. And it is one simple circuit that you can do five times a day, every day. fucking ass up and work it seems like nobody wants to work these days you that's have to, so true you have to surround yeah. yourself all right y'all let's get it so the first workout that i'm doing is going to be a bicep curl now i do not know the terminology for these workouts okay i still don't i told y'all i was gonna research but i did not okay all I know is that I watch videos and I mimic what they're doing. So that's what I need y'all to do right here. Okay, I love this exercise. As you can see, boy, look at them triceps. Yes, it's working biceps and triceps, okay? But no, really, you only feel the burn in your bicep. The tricep is just popping. These are the easiest and quickest workouts that you can do to see results in your arms. I was doing this for about a month and I automatically noticed that my arms were more toned. And it's definitely from these right here. If you look closely, you can see which muscle that um, this workout is targeting. I did three sets of 10, but you're always more than welcome to go until failure. This last set was definitely the hardest set. I almost couldn't finish it, but I pushed myself. Don't lose form like I am right here, but it was really tough towards the end, so I was just trying to push myself no matter what it looked like. If you don't know, now you know a part of getting an hourglass shape in the gym is working your upper body, okay? So first I'm starting off with these parallel lab pulls. I think that's what these are called. I'm so sorry if I butchered that. But I'm pulling, trying to keep my arms parallel, my elbows tucked in, and I am just pulling. I did one set of 10, and the second set of 10, I spread my arms a little further, and this is that last set of 10 where I spread my arms the widest. And check out my back gains, y'all. This exercise, is what can take credit for these back gains. All right, let's get into the postpartum ab circuit. You're gonna do five tabletop crunches, then you're gonna go into the elbow knee touches, and then you're gonna touch your toes but first you're gonna extend and then touch. But on that extension, you don't let your heels or the back of your hands touch the ground, okay? And you wanna do this about five times. I went until failure and I failed on the fifth time, yeah. Ow. That circuit is five times nonstop. After the circuit, I had a 30 second rest and then I went straight into plank twists and I did three sets of 10. Touching both sides of the mat is one. I promise if you do this ab circuit every day or every other day for a couple months, you will see results, even if it's postpartum, okay? Thank y'all so much for watching this video and continuously supporting me. Make sure you subscribe and I will see you in my next video.